Hello champions, if you're writing your CA inter exams in Jan 26, then this video is really important for you because there are two amendments in direct tax that you should be aware of. The first amendment is with respect to section 54EC. In 54EC, SSE transfers any immovable property and SSE acquires bonds, guys. We already have four specified bonds in 54EC and that is your NHGI bonds, REC bonds, IRFC bonds and PFCI bonds. Now, the amendment is that one more bond has been notified and that is bonds of HUDCO, that is bonds of Housing and Urban Development Corporation of India provided these bonds were acquired on or after 1st April 25. Your second amendment is in section 139AA. This section makes it mandatory to quote the Aadhaar number in two places in your PAN application and in your ITR. But however, before 1st October 24, we also had the option of quoting the enrollment ID instead. So those assessees who before 1st October 24 in their PAN application, they have quoted their enrollment ID, such assessees have to now intimate their Aadhaar number to the prescribed authority by 31st December 25. So these are your two amendments. The first amendment is in section 54EC. The second one is in section 139AA. In case you want a little more clarity, I have discussed both of these amendments in full depth in my YouTube video. And you can also download this PDF from my website under free resources. And also ensure you share this video with each of your friends who is appearing for the Jan 26 exam.